So here we have two MF8 Super Square One puzzles. Now I didn't buy these puzzles like this, these actually started off um, like this. Basically a Super Square One column and a Super Square One star. A, well a black and white Super Square One column and a black and white Super Square One star. Now those two puzzles, they felt a bit too easy to solve. Um, I didn't really need any algorithms, I just kind of used intuition. And because they were so easy to solve, they just didn't feel that fun to solve. And one day I had the idea of just taking them apart and swapping the pieces over with each other and seeing if I can make um, a more interesting puzzle or two more interesting puzzles out of them. And I came up with these. Uh, so here we have an MFA, a black and white MFA Super Square One I and a, uh, a black and white uh, normal super MF8 Super Square One can't tell properly. Um, so yeah, I'll show you this uh, this I1. These are actually a lot more of a challenge to solve than the the column and the star. In fact, I can't actually solve this one. The reason why you're seeing it in its solved state now is because when it was scrambled, I ended up taking it apart to lube it, and then obviously when I assembled it, I uh, I assembled it into its solved state. And there you can see the, the MF8 logos. And it, uh, it turns really well. And here we have the uh, the black and white super square one. So it's basically in the shape of a regular square one. I've only solved this a couple of times up to now. And um, it seems to be more easier than the than like a, a stickered uh, regular super square one. Um, but for all I know, the next time I solve this, I may run into a parity that you don't get on the on the regular stickered one and which could make this actually more difficult I don't know but this is a it, you know it's still a challenge to solve and it's still fun to solve um, it's more fun to solve than again it's more fun to solve than the uh, than the black and white column and the uh, the black and white star turning is uh, it's pretty good on the outer layers the middle layers though they turn okay but they feel quite a bit more stiffer than the outer layers. Yeah, I'm even this circle in the middle it's it's quite difficult actually. Maybe I should uh, tension this more. So yeah, so this is uh, is kind of like a bigger brother to this uh, limited edition Calvin's black and white square one. So I'm guessing that these are probably quite rare because I've not seen any pictures of these online anywhere. I've not seen them for sale anywhere, um, which is quite surprising because you'd think that if um, if the manufacturer or if if maybe it's the the people who sell them, if they've um, if they've made black and white columns and black and white stars, you'd think that they'd also make um, black and white eyes and black and white regular shaped square ones because it's really easy to do. You just swap the the pieces over with each other um, so it's kind of strange why that hasn't been done I'm sure there must at least be a handful of people in the world who have done the same thing that I've done so I'm sure there'll be at least a few a few of these probably somewhere in the world um, but I think they are probably quite rare but yeah I think I think they're much I think these are much better than how they were when they were a column 
and a, a star. I think they're a lot more of a challenge to uh, to solve, and they're a lot more fun to solve as well. So what I'll do is I'll scramble them both so you can see what they look like when they're scrambled. Yeah, it is a bit awkward trying to scramble these when I'm sat behind a tripod and camera. So there is a scrambled, uh, regular shaped black and white super square one. So uh, let's start scrambling this eye. Yeah, these puzzles they are a bit tricky to uh, to turn by the slice through the middle. Um, that's nothing to do with the way I've assembled them. That's just the way these puzzles are. Um, you know, even when even when they were a column and a, a star, they were like that. Um, yeah, I guess you could call that fully scrambled now. So that is a fully scrambled black and white uh, MF8 Super Square 1 eye. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.